Big Root. I mean, so if we ever get a Pokemon that was absorbed, that could help out. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> It's the second legendary already! What the fuck's Weather Ball? I think it only knows Weather Ball. You know what? Let's put this experience between Bugs and that Metalhead. Because hopefully I can get like Thunder Punch, Fire Punch, and all that stuff for. Her. Be serious. What? See, I thought for that, I, I thought when enemies, oh, is it a, I know usually when a trainer uses Whirlwind, it just pushes out a Pokemon for another Pokemon. So I thought when a wild Pokemon did it do the same, since, you know, it's not really doing anything to itself. Let's throw a weirdo out. Man, I'm set, that would have been some great experience, too. Goodbye, Shieldion. Yeah, let's switch to Metalhead for that. I mean, I don't know. We could have kept Weirdo out for that. Weirdo does take reduced damage from electric attacks. Ooh, now give me that sweet experience, please. That wasn't as much as I thought. Well, let's we'll just keep going, by the way. Another item. Frostberry. Oh. What the fuck? I don't know what the fuck's going on here. <laughs> going on here? See, I don't know what that was about. <laughs> that was weird shit. Oh, hey, Magby. That was the third starter I could have chosen in my other playthrough. It was Krikatoon, Magby, and then Mistrevious. I was thinking about going with Magby, but since it's a baby mod, it probably would have sucked. Let's hope this game don't mess up again. I don't even know how that even happened before. Boom, gauntlet, let's go. 
I really hope we get another remake of this game soon. Since it's not too far out there, since we've already had two remakes of Fog. Or no. Three remakes? Or no, two remakes of Generation 1. And it even got technically three because of it being remade for this game? It's probably not gonna happen, but I, I just love Johto. Like, I can only imagine what Johto would look like with modern day graphics. Like, shit, make that shit look like Breath of the Wild. Please don't tell me randomized flash, that's that'd suck. <laughs> huh, what you gonna do without the supersonic boy? Cop thing. I like how this tower is full of cops, and there's a fucking dude who stole a Pokemon just casually running around. Cop Joe sent out Swallow. Cop Joe, are you a thought? <laughs> Yawning. I know my commentary sucks, but please. Shit. at least give Bugs a decent chunk of experience. Ooh, you know what? Let me throw out Metalhead so at least he gets some credit for this kill. And then let's throw out Weirdo. Vine Whip? Pretty fast. Oof. Good job, Brito. any more potions. I gotta go back to the Pokemon Center again. Alright, so we'll be back. We put Metalhead in the front of our party. And now let's go and fight this dude. Uh, we 
showed us what you got and is indeed good. Take this TM, however you should care more about your Pokemon. You treat them way too harsh. Remember, Pokemon are not tools of war. Hmm. He calls himself an elder, but he was no sweet match for me. I mean, sure enough, those who actually mean to me nice Pokemon, you can't defeat me. All I care about is strong Pokemon. <laughs> the rest of them don't mean anything to me. Damn, you an escape for it. Oh shit, that reminds me. Since it's Christmas, well, not Christmas, but since it's the holiday season, we should be put on that festo shit. Let's put that on fast, and there we go. You know, um, and while we're at it, if we're ever gonna have to look at our Coke gear, I would like to switch to the Team Rocket theme. Because I've been on that good old Pokemon Let's Go, boy. And you know, I just like the Team Rocket aesthetic. Not mind me just moving stuff around. What's this? I know this is the, this, it's supposed to be the escape, but I just want to see what it is before I fight the dude. Yeah, it sounds like a little fart. <laughs> Energy powder. Garbage. Yo, Arcanine. Man, I used one of my playthrough. Let's go, and I love Arcanine. Uh, so good of you to come here. Sprout Towers, place the training, peak the Pokemon into bonds, bright as futures together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between you and your Pokemon. Boy, you don't even know how tight this tie is. You're looking so formal. You're going to a wedding. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm basically just going to kill them all with Metalhead. Well, depending on what they are. Oh man, Splash. How would I ever go through that? Bombastone. Definitely not a good match for her, you know. So let's keep let's, let's keep Metalhead up. Lady Esteban. <laughs> uh, I didn't know this police station was ran by Lady Esteban. doing though. You know who I'm throwing out. Let's go weirdo. You can do this. You got this. Weirdo. You got this. One shot. One shot. Show him no mercy. Weirdo, come on. Water rock? This is... Come on dude. What, what was that? I know he's using Harden, but come on. So all throughout Bellsprout Tower, there's only one trainer that used anything even remotely related to Bellsprout. And that was Weeping Bell. Bada bing bada boom, we'll hit level 10. <laughs> level 11. Jesus, <laughs> that was so much experience! I thought it was elegant, you should be able to stand up to Falconer, and you should be able to even make good use of this. It's kind of a machine called Flash. Is it though? Is it though? Magma Storm? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Bruh. This fucking sucks too because we need Flash. I don't think any Pokemon that we've met so far at least can learn it naturally. Ah, 
I might have to look up a map for caves that require flash, because it's not an HM. So it gave me an option too to like... There was a box that I specifically did not check that said like, make sure TMs like, dig or like, teleport do not change, and I felt like flash would go under that. You wanna go again, Ho-Oh? Do you wanna go again? We will throw down. We will throw down. Let's end this episode off of me killing Ho-Oh. What are we gonna do? Hit with the weather ball? No, you're gonna fucking run away. <laughs> God damn it. Shit, this is like six episodes. So, I hope y'all guys had a good time watching. This was entertaining for me. I'll, try, I'll probably trim down the fluff in editing so it's not an hour and a half of the like, stuff. So. I know I said I was going to get to the first gym, but I didn't anticipate how long it would take to go through um, Bell Sprout Tower and all that. So next time we'll be tackling Falconer's Gym and hope to god you don't have anything with like Wonder Guard or any legendaries. So if you like this, please go down to the description, hit that fucking link to my Twitter, follow me for updates and shit. Um, if you would like to see this be more of a Nuzlocke, let me know. You know, so far we haven't gone against any Nuzlocke rules, so it's still not too late to decide if we're doing a full Nuzlocke. Um, so yeah, fucking, I'll catch y'all later. So until then, bye bye